Hi guys, it's about noon and I decided kind of randomly that I would just vlog today and we'll see where the day takes us. So my best friend, she actually texted me a couple hours ago and was like, hey, I'm gonna go to Hobby Lobby. Do you wanna go with me? So this might be kind of fun. Um, see if they have any fun like Valentine's Day decor, stuff like that. And I thought I would share it with you guys and I really don't know what I'm doing the rest of the day today. Um, I was planning on just like working on editing some videos and stuff, but we'll see if I have some entertaining things to share with you. So I'm just waiting for her to get here. She should be here any minute. I'll bring you guys along and I'm kind of hoping I find a couple cute things. I never really decorate for Valentine's Day, but I thought this year it might be fun just to put out a couple little cute things. So we'll see. Here with my best friend. Okay. We're going into Hobby Lobby. Maybe a Michael's situation too. Mm -hmm. yep. Okay, here is some of the Valentine's Day decor. I saw my best friend Jessica decorated for Valentine's Day, so I had to. So I have this garland. I had it out for Christmas and I put it away, so gotta find something else. Um, Come on, guys. It's currently the next day. I didn't end up vlogging very much at Hobby Lobby because honestly I feel like they didn't have that much like Valentine's Day decor. They had like a lot of like things to make crafts and stuff like that but not actual like home decor so anyway didn't really vlog much there and my friend and I were just having a great time so I'm gonna show you guys what we did end up getting and then we actually popped into Michael's super super quick too because I wanted to get this garland this is the same garland that my friend has up on her mantle and so she said she got it from Michael so we popped in there really quick so I could get it too it was like I think it was like 14 bucks and then it was 30% off. So I think this will look really cute. I want to put it on my mantle too, but I have to figure out some other things to maybe go up there or how I'm going to hang it. I never really decorate for Valentine's Day, so I got to kind of figure out like what I want to do. And then this is the stuff that we got because we're having like a couple's Valentine's Day party like with our group of friends this year. So we just got like some random Valentine's Day decor, like some little pretty napkins. Everything was 40% off. These little balloons that we thought were cute. A uh, tablecloth with little hearts on it. Paper plates. Cause we just thought they were pretty. I and mean, then these really special hanging things. So we thought that'll be fun for our little party that we'll be having. So I thought I would just continue vlogging today because I didn't get that much footage yesterday. And a lot of you have been asking me just to do like more casual vlog style videos. So that's what this one is going to be. So we're actually going to be hanging out with our friends tonight. We're having game night tonight. And Joshua saw a game at Target the other day. And he's like, we should have got that game. So we're going to run over there really quick. And I thought while well, we're there, I could see if they had any Valentine's Day decor that I needed. Maybe just to finish up my mantle or anything. I don't want to do a ton of stuff. It's not like Christmas or anything. I just thought it would be nice to have like a couple cute things sitting out. While I'm waiting for him to we go to Target, I thought I would show you guys a couple things that I just got in the mail. Um, this literally just came to my door a couple minutes ago. It's an order from Target. I don't know exactly what's in this one. Oh, okay. This is the Joy Lab collection, which is like a really cute workout section at Target. But I got this, and tie-dye is really in right now too. Does anybody else notice that? So I got this. It's like shorter in the front, longer in the back. I got another one the other day that looks almost identical to this. Um, I already opened it. It's upstairs. So I'm going to grab it so I can show you guys. But this um, style shirt looks really, really cute with leggings because it's super lightweight. So this was like $29.99 and the fabric feels like really soft and stuff. And then this one has, what does this bag have in it? My last Target Shop With Me video, I actually showed some of the Joy Lab stuff that they had in. And then these, these really pretty ribbed sports bras and um, leggings. I don't know why I couldn't think of that word. <laughs> so while I was there, I assumed that I would be like a small, I think. And then I was like, oh, they don't have any smalls. So I, I thought, oh, I'll just order it online. Well, they didn't have it online when I got home, but I've been checking every day. It's finally online. And I'm gonna link this stuff down below because I actually had a couple people 
um, messaging me about it on Instagram too. This is what the little sports bra looks like. I gotta get a really good view of this because it's ribbed. And the reason why this is so special too is because <laughs> Free People has some very, very similar to this for like 50 or $60. And this one is only $19.99 and that's full price and you guys know like you can always get some sort of deal at Target with like the cartwheel app and stuff. So it's ribbed. Originally I ordered this in a light blue color and I have that one upstairs. I'll grab it and show it to you guys. And I got it in a small and it was actually, it fit but for a sports bra you want like a little bit more hold. I thought I could go down a size. So I think definitely go with your smaller size if you guys want to get this. It doesn't have like padding in it though. So just a heads up if you guys order it. But I thought this. And then I also ordered the leggings too. But those aren't supposed to get here till tomorrow. But I thought this with the leggings. And this is just like a really cute little outfit. And then let me grab the things that I got the other day. So these are the ones that came in the mail the other day. This really pretty light blue color and this is ribbed as well. And the reason why I like these sports bras so much, they're like longer length, which is cool. I also grabbed another one of these sweatshirts and I tried it on, it looks really cute on. It's oversized and it's not tie dye like the other one, but kind of has a wash sort of like that longer in the back and yeah it just looks really cute on this one was also $29.99 so super cute and since i'm on a roll of showing you guys all of the new things that i recently purchased so these are a couple boots that I actually ordered from the Nordstrom website. Little backstory, I have a gift card that I've been kind of like waiting to use and I was going to get those Doc Martin boots. I see a lot of people on Instagram wearing them now. But they just look like a very chunky military style boot but they're almost like $200. So I've been a little hesitant about it because I'm like, oh, I don't know if I'll wear them a lot. So I'm on the Nordstrom site the other day and Pretty much all of my shoes are Steve Madden. I just really like Steve Madden shoes and I typed in Steve Madden. A pair of shoes that are almost identical to the Doc Martin ones came up. They're, they were normally like $112 and they were on sale for $44. There were two different styles and I ended up just ordering both just to see because I was like, I don't know that I don't know how long they're gonna be on sale and I don't know which ones I'm gonna like better. And I ordered a few different sizes too, just in case, because it said order a half size up. These are the two boots that I ordered. First are these ones, which look very, very similar to the Doc Martin boots. They just don't have like a zipper on the side, which I think the Doc Martins have. But these are them, they're just like really chunky, only $44. And Steve Madden's shoes are always like really good quality and they're always really comfortable like i said like all my shoes are steve Madden, and i just love them so i ended up getting these ones which i thought were really cute and i'm normally a seven i ordered a seven and a half and an eight in these shoes because i was i just didn't know honestly the seven and a half fits good and the eight fits good so i don't really know i was just kind of getting worried online when it said order a half size out so this is the other one that i got it's kind of like a patent leather tight boot really fun though so I'm not sure which ones I like better so I could just keep both because honestly the price for both of these was still like way less than just one pair of Doc Martin boots so I might keep both of them keep in mind if you guys want to order these shoes I'm normally always a seven so the sizing on these is kind of weird so I gotta figure out which ones I want and yeah i just think they're kind of cool i like how like chunky they are i know those shoes definitely won't be for everyone but i think they're fun okay i saw a couple cute things these little pictures five dollars they have little hearts on them but they're really adorable and then i thought these were really these little vases or beverage server i guess you could use it as either were really pretty too and then these trays these were fun. It has like gold on it. This one says let's do brunch. I just thought those were pretty. So I'm not really sure what I'm looking for to decorate for Valentine's Day. I don't want 
like a ton of stuff, but I just thought it might be cute to decorate like my mantle or have a couple things out. They have some cute little paper plates, uh, whatever that is, straws, napkins. I like these little cups too. There's two for three dollars. They have like a gold rim on them. I think I do have a couple Valentine's Day cups. I don't think I really need cups, but I have some little signs. Oh, a chalkboard. I have a chalkboard too. These are really cute. Okay. I kind of love this sweatshirt. It's the Fifth Sun brand, which is always like really cozy stuff. I just think that's cute. I'm just kind of looking around, see if they have anything, anything else. Every time I'm here, I kind of want this little corduroy puffer coat. I've seen a lot of brands have these now. They're $8, but it is so cute. I saw online it comes in like a light blue color as well. But it's so cute. Found Joshua in all the games. If you guys ever have any questions about games, Joshua's your guy. You can message him on Instagram. <laughs> <laughs> He's very good at picking out games. I don't see a ton of like Valentine's Day decor. Not a ton. There's like these little flowers, wreaths, stuff like that. That's a pretty garland down there. Well, Josh was still looking at the like, games and stuff. I thought I do have to just kind of take a peek around, even though I was here a few days ago. It's just kind of protocol. These are the hearth and hand little mugs. Those are cute. They have a lot of really pretty like pink stuff, I noticed. Pink little linen napkins. And then they have these really cute little dish towels too. That kind of have like a little bit of a light pink. Okay, I've been looking for Valentine's Day decor. I'm really not finding like a ton. There's like a lot of like kitchen stuff. But I wasn't really wanting kitchen stuff. And then there is this little mini waffle maker, oh which is gosh. super cute. <laughs> 10 bucks. But yeah, this is all like the Opal House line. They have like a bunch of mugs and stuff, which is the last thing I need. But I thought I would just show them to you guys because they are cute. This stuff isn't glass either, it's like plastic. But it wasn't really what I was looking for. Joshua just found this. How cute is this little mini Dutch oven? Black with a gold top. Oh, so adorable. I have my white one now. That's a gold top that Joshua's mom got me for Christmas. But this is just so cute. We are back from Target. And I thought I would show you guys what we got. We didn't get that much stuff. I ended up finding this on the clearance wrap. It was regularly $20 and it was like $10 even. And it's just like a comfy little cropped sweatshirt. They only had it in a large, so I got it in a large, but I really don't like my sweatshirts to be like fitted or anything, so. I just thought, I don't know, that might be kind of cute. And then Joshua picked out two games. Now, something that we always like to keep in mind for our friend group is that our friends both have kids. So it's a lot easier to have games that don't have like a ton of pieces and stuff like that because everything might just get lost or something like that so not that that's like a terrible thing it's just easier to play games that don't have like a ton of pieces so this is the game we got today we've never played it most likely to Joshua's i'm here to explain the games <laughs> most likely to uh you just pull out a card hey i'll pick it up you just pull out a card and like an example is have a 20 minute conversation with siri so you vote who in the group would most likely do that. Pretty easy game. I don't know what any other cards Just kind say, of so. like fun. Yeah. 
And then, this one looked really fun to me. This is like a timer and it's more of like a challenge. So you do something that says like, you split into two teams. You say like, arrange your team in height order. So then the blue or the yellow team has to do that. And when they're done, they flip it. And then these beads go to the other side and you keep competing until some, one of the team's beads are gone. And then that team loses. So you keep doing crazy things like pretend your shoe is a phone and call for pizza. And then you flip it when you're done doing that. And you just keep flipping and flipping and flipping. So fun. I'm excited to play kinda that fun. one. Kind of like catchphrase. So those are the two games that we picked up this time. We have a ton of games. And that's mainly because of Joshua. Because he loves games. But we get a lot of games like this. What are the other games we've played with our friends? Things. Things. The voting game. Those if are ones. Want, we can do like a board game review. Yeah. Oh, catchphrase. But those are all like good games that don't have like a ton of pieces if you guys are looking for games like that. So that's everything that we ended up getting at Target. Ladies and gentlemen, meet Abigail in her new sweater. Ba -ba 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 Dun 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 That's gotta go in it. Okay, so this is my new sweatshirt. <laughs> it's cropped, so I'm really glad I got a larger size. But it's super cute. It was ten dollars, and it's very cozy. I'll link it down below. And man, it's upstairs. He's about to eat my slippers, so I gotta go get them. <laughs> surprise, surprise! It is the next day again. But I wanted to just hop on here and thank you guys so much for watching this video. This kind of like casual vlog style video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please make sure to hit that thumbs up button and also subscribe if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet. I'm going to leave some links down below for a bunch of the things that I mentioned in this video. I still have my comfy sweatshirt on. It truly is very comfortable. So make sure to check out the description box if you guys are looking for any of the items that I talked about in today's video. But I hope you guys have a very great week. I'm gonna finish up editing this video and I will see you really soon in my next one.